the sliding doesn't want to cooperate, but we're gonna do this. Oh, I forgot lipstick. What's up guys? Today we're gonna be doing a top 10. I kind of started this series with my favorite palettes. I mean, I don't really remember when I posted that, but I figured, you know, in every category of makeup, I could give you guys like my favorite top 10 whatevers. Know what I mean? <laughs> so today we're gonna be doing highlighters and highlighter palettes. Also, I realize like every video is like being filmed on my bed right now, but this is like the only clean section of my room. So <laughs> my room looks like a construction zone. Uh, I'll explain later. <laughs> anyway, let's get started. So I feel like before I show you what I have, I would tell you like the kind of highlighters that I look for for my skin type. So I have extremely textured skin, okay? My pores are ginormous. I say that in like every video. You guys get it, you get it. Because I have such textured skin, I tend to gear towards more natural highlights. I tend to prefer highlights that are smoother on the skin, that are more like a sheen, you know? So I'm gonna show you all of my favorite highlighters. Now keep in mind, I'm bougie. <laughs> so most of these are high-end. And also keep in mind, all of these are very similar. And I'll like let you guys know, let me just, you know what, let me just stop talking and just tell you what I like. <laughs> so I do have a few drugstore highlighters that I really like. So I'm gonna start with those. The first one, I think I've, I've mentioned this like crazy. This is the Essence Pure Nude Highlighter. This is in the color Be My Highlight. I think they also have like a darker gold one now that would be beautiful on like deeper skin tones. I think I may even be able to use that because this is like borderline almost too light for me. I have to be very careful with this in the summertime. But this is like a bridal glow. This is like I woke up like this kind of glow. You know what I'm saying? This is a sheen. It's very skin-like. It looks Looks like your skin just be like that this is not like a metallic highlight it's not glittery it's not chunky it's just it's just a natural sheen you know what I'm saying like almost like like just do you can actually even if you have dry skin you could even put this all over your face for like a dewy look I don't though I'm dewy as hell all on my own <laughs> The next drugstore highlight, this one is like a no-brainer. Everybody, everybody lost their marbles over this one when it came out. This is the Maybelline Master Chrome by Face Studio. This is in the color Molten Gold. Do you see this? First of all, gold highlights are just like my favorite. I feel like they go best with my skin. And this one is just, oh, this one is just so metallic, so smooth. It's not glittery, it doesn't accentuate your texture. It's just a beautiful golden sheen. This is really nice if you're like going out at night and you wanna look like beaming, or you can use a light hand for like the daytime. Me personally, I beam like whatever time of day, I don't care. <laughs> but this is perfect for like medium to deep skin tones. I love this highlight and it's affordable. I think it's like $8. I hope. This next one is actually a highlight palette. This is from ColourPop. This is the In Nude Endo. I don't know, I don't know how to say it. Nude, In Nude, whatever, whatever, whatever. <laughs> this is a highlighting palette. This is actually really similar to the Anastasia Nicole Guerrero highlight palette. Surprisingly, I actually like this one more. I love both and I'll, I'll We'll, we'll talk about it, but I really really love this highlighting palette. It's super smooth the colors tailored to like everybody I can even wear this white one just like dusted lightly <laughs> Again, these are very smooth. They're not glittery. They're not chunky. They sit on the skin very nicely I normally use a setting spray after I put them on to kind of like you know sink everything in it's beaming it's beautiful and it's affordable and Again, it's a dupe for the Anastasia Nicole Guerrero palette. Wonderful stuff, wonderful. All the rest of these highlight palettes are high-end. And some of these aren't just highlight palettes. And it's kind of annoying, well, let me just, let me just, this one is kind of annoying because it comes with like a bunch of other stuff. But like this highlight right here, this is really similar to the Essence highlighter in the sense that it's just like very smooth, very sheeny, not like metallic, it just looks like your skin. This is from, this is the Lorac Los Angeles palette. This is, 
I don't even know what this is. It doesn't even really have a name on it. But the highlight is called Sunlight, and it's like perfect. When I have a tan in the summertime, ooh, watch out, okay? Just watch out. And this one, this this is also like a highlighty blush, but it's like a little bit too deep for me. You can't even tell. I really love this highlight. I wonder if they sell it like individually. I should find out. But this in the summertime, oh my God. And I do, I like, it's not just the highlight that I like in this palette also. I love literally everything in this palette. Everything in here is very smooth. It blends out really well. This is a really good palette. I think I got that at Namie's in LA. I don't know where else you can get it. Uh, sorry. <laughs> the next one, this is the Smashbox Cali Contour Kit. And I love this whole palette. This, this whole thing is just like an incredible value. And I think I got this on sale for like 20 bucks or something like that. I can't remember. And I, I mainly got it for like the contour and bronzer stuff, but these two highlighters in the middle, so amazing. They're sheeny, they're smooth. I feel like I'm just saying the same thing about every single highlight. These are not beaming though. These are not like your nighttime highlights. They're not gonna be like beaming off your face. They're more like a natural type of glow. Those you could probably dust all over your face also. I wouldn't because I have pores. <laughs> the next one, this is a cult favorite. This is the Ofra Highlighter in Rodeo Drive. I have two of these. <laughs> That's how much I love it. This is a nighttime highlight. This will have you beaming. And it's one of the few highlights that is so metallic but doesn't actually accentuate my texture. This makes me look smooth. Well, I, I wouldn't say it makes me look smooth, but it looks smooth on my textured skin. It doesn't blur anything or anything. It just doesn't accentuate anything. And the color is just beautiful. If you're like my shade, oh, I'm like running out of space here. Oh, come on guys, come on. <laughs> really love this. It's buttery, it blends out well, it's beaming, it's beautiful, I love it. Okay, so the next one isn't actually one specific highlight. It's like a group of highlights. Okay, so the next one is Becca highlights. These are like my favorite highlights of all time. Whenever in doubt, Becca. Now, these are expensive, but there's a reason for that. <laughs> you get what you pay for. I promise. <laughs> so this is the color. This is Prosecco Pop. This is Champagne Pop. And this is Rose Gold. All of these go with everything. I'm just saying. If I had to only pick one highlighter for the rest of my life, it would be Champagne Pop. It's this one. These are so smooth, so metallic, so buttery, so soft. They blend out so well. This has to be like my favorite formula of highlighters. I'm going to swatch them just because I feel like I have to. This is Champagne Pop. Oh. This is Prosecco Pop. This is Rose Gold. Aye, aye. <laughs> and this is Rose Gold. Oh, you can't even see Rose Gold. It's too dark in here. Oh, and Opal is also my shit. I have that somewhere. I just can't remember where I put it. I have so many things just scattered everywhere. My life is in shambles right now. <laughs> Anyway, anyway, these are my favorite highlights, like of all time. Whenever in doubt, these are the ones I run to. Jess. The next one, this is the Anastasia Nicole Guerrero. Oh, I still have the sheet in here. Does anybody else do that? I still have the sleeve and the sheet that goes in here. <laughs> anyway, this is the Nicole Guerrero Anastasia Glow Kit. I love this. This is like your going out, your special occasion, your photo shoot type glow kit. These have glitter in them, okay? These these have a lot of glitter in them. I don't ever highlight in the center of my face with this because it's just, it's gonna accentuate texture. But they are so beaming. They are just like, just so out of this world, okay? This is a great, great glow kit. If you can't get your hand, actually, was this limited edition? Damn it, should I be talking about this? Uh, sorry. <laughs> anyway, I just, I love the colors in here. I love the formula. It's a very metallic formula. These are the three highlights on the very top right here. They're beautiful. You can use this for every day. You can use this for special occasions. This is just, she, she, she did the damn thing, okay? I'm gonna put the sleeve back in here because I'm OCD about stuff like this. 
This palette looks brand new. It looks like I've never used it. <laughs> okay, this one. This one, this one is a problem. Uh, and I don't necessarily like recommend going out and getting like a whole kit for like one highlight. <laughs> I love this whole kit. This whole kit is like, you know, uh, what do they call that? A great value. It is a great value. So this is the Benefit Cheek Leader Bronze Squad palette. This whole kit is amazing. First of all, you get a brush, you get two blushes, two bronzers, and a highlight. I think I think one bronzer is like 25, 30 bucks. So five of them, and I think I paid like 60 bucks for this. Awesome value. If this is still available, run. Don't walk. Anyway, this highlight. Oh my god. First of all, it looks extremely glittery in the pan. At first when I saw it, I was like, damn it, I'm not gonna like that. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it's so smooth. It is so beaming. This is like one of my favorite highlights in my collection. I will literally bust this whole kit out just for this one highlight. <laughs> I love that highlight. Now, the only problem with this is, this highlight is not sold individually. I'm pretty sure you have to get this whole kit for this highlight. So, Benefit needs to get on that. They need to sell this one highlight, cause it's bomb, bomb.com, <laughs> slash your mom. <laughs> now, I know I said those Becca highlighters are like my favorite of all time, but this one, this one has a special place in my heart. This is the first highlight palette that I ever bought. And whenever in doubt, I always run to this one. This, this has to be like my favorite, just makeup purchase period of all time. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in Sun Dipped. First of all, this is this is this is the highlight palette that I'm I'm wearing right now. I know I know you see this glow. Okay. First of all, let me just say, the colors in here amazing. If you're a brown girl and you're like about my complexion, you can literally use everything in here. I know it doesn't look like it, but these two if you're if you dust them lightly, they're not actually as dark as they look in the pan. I'm actually wearing this one today. Right? Right, right? I look so cute. <laughs> but these two, I gear more towards the winter time. These two more towards the summertime. And I mean, they look dark in the pan, but let me show you, let me, like you see, it's not as dark as it looks in the pan. They're so smooth, so buttery. This is like the best Anastasia Glow Kit ever. Okay, I said it, I said it. Anyway, that's it. If anybody's wondering, the lip color that I'm wearing is called Barbecue and it's from MAC. I just feel like I want to throw that in there because I feel like someone's going to ask me. And now that I've said it, probably nobody's going to ask me. Anyway, <laughs> that's it guys. Those are all my favorite highlighters. Most of them, like I said, are high end. I am who I am, okay? I'm not sorry. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe and stay tuned. Is it recording? <laughs> Why do I have a hair on me? Like, if you had, like, what, if I had, if I could, <sighs> this is actually the, the top row, the, the, t the four, the, uh, the, just, <laughs> the top highlights, or, <laughs> why can't I talk? This whole kit is, like, amazing. What just fell out of here? Oh, the brush.